What's up everybody, Vigilant Bag here. Now, this is not a normal video I'm going to be making. You can screw off. Um, this, I guess you could say, is kind of a PSA in a sense. So, recently, one of my friends downloaded a virus that um, actually did a lot more harm than I thought it would. Some of the things that it has done is it, first of all, it deleted the group policy editor in Windows, so we can't change anything in there. And second of all, his Windows Defender was, um, was turned off by default in the group policy editor. So there's no way for us to turn that on, even in safe mode we couldn't even get it back. Um, what it also has done is it has also removed his ability to connect to the internet. So therefore, he can't download any antivirus stuff. And um, we tried uh, putting antivirus software onto a flash drive, put on his computer. It wouldn't work. So today, I am going to show you the three best ways to keep your computer safe. In this case, three of the best antivirus softwares that you should be using that are free. So, first of all, for web browser safety, you would want to see Avira Browser Safety. This one is a browser extension for Chrome in the Chrome Web Store. It is called Avira Browser Safety. Now, basically what this does is any website you look up, so example, if I look up YouTube, um, on the left hand side you would see if it is either safe or not with a green or red shield with an X or a check mark inside the shield. Now in this case YouTube is safe so example if we went into YouTube and then we clicked on the Vera browser safety icon you could see if it is safe or not and you can see what trackers it uses. Now, by default, Avira Browser Safety blocks trackers that it recognizes. So, I guess that could be some, some usefulness in case any sketchy websites you might go on that you know of have, you know, some kind of tracking. Now, we'll check out Malwarebytes. Obviously, this is probably, this is probably something you already have on your computer, but, um, the reason why we are using three, not just Malwarebytes in a, in a Vera browser safety, is because Malwarebytes only has 30 days, I think, approximately 30 days until you have to pay for it for the full version of Malwarebytes. Now the full version of Malwarebytes has basically real-time scanning. So let's go ahead and download this. And we want that real-time scanning. So another thing we would enable is let me just get this done is Sophos Home now Sophos might seem like a little bit of a small or sketchy company to you but to be honest is actually pretty useful I actually do use it um, and it's actually saved me from quite a bit of stuff that I had on my computer that I thought was safe but I also thought it was sketchy once I when I downloaded it. Um, but the way to get it is you have to make an account first and then it would give you a link to either install to your current computer which then it'll go through the setup process and you'll be in or uh, copy a link which um, see right here yeah uh, what Malwarebytes does is it basically disables um, uh, Windows Defender by default that's alright and so it will give you a link to click on if you already have this or if you need to download this on another computer because you could have up to 10 uh, devices linked to one account although making an account is free and the software is free now I will not be doing this right now but essentially what it will look like to you is you'll go through the download process and then it would show you the screen that's done and once it's done the only the only way to configure the settings in Sophos Home 
is to go on their website and log into your account. From there, you could change whatever you want. You could set any filters to let anything through or block anything. Uh, and by default, it blocks almost everything that it deems to be suspicious. So, it also has a web safety function, which we are not going to use, so you could disable that in the dashboard. So, those are the three antivirus softwares that you should be using right now to help not get a serious virus that would terminate your computer, your brand new computer, <laughs> in my friend's case, from any viruses that will severely damage your system.